This morning, cold weather can create all sorts of headaches, so it's important to be prepared for. CBS 42 News reporter Conan Gasquey joins us live in Birmingham with a look at how to prepare your car for the cold weather. Conan? Well, guys, I'm here with an expert on hand. This is Randy Harris with Express Oil joining us this morning to kind of give us some advice about what you need to know about your car in the cold weather. Randy, thanks so much for joining us. One of the first things people are going to see when they walk outside this morning is frost on their windshield. There's a right way and a wrong way to get rid of that. There is. I think it's great to invest in a good ice scraper. I think that's the, one of the easiest and cheapest things that you can do. A lot of people have been told just to go out and pour hot water on their windshield. You absolutely don't want to, yeah, absolutely don't want to do that. You want to use an ice scraper and then if you want to start your car early in the morning, which most of us want to do, we want to get in a warm car, make sure when you turn your your heater on, make sure it's on the floor and crack your window about that much on either side that way if you have any chips or any breaks in your glass, that won't cause it to expand and then ruin your windshield. Yeah, cuz that that hot air could uh, cause that expansion Absolutely. like you were saying and really create some windshield problems. Another piece of advice you were telling me uh, just a minute ago is it, it's good to let your car run for at least a few minutes and there's a specific reason for that. There is because uh, on cold mornings, the oil will become more thick, more viscous. And so when you start your car, you want to give the car a little bit of time to pull that oil up from the pan, begin to lubricate the engine, uh, because the longer your engine runs without oil in the top, the more friction there is, the more engine wear there is, so that can cause some problems down the road. And so, of course, as we mentioned, people are going to see that frost this morning, but there's also another alert inside their right. car that they need to look out for, too. Right. Since 2007, uh, all, cars have what's called a tire pressure monitoring system, or TPMS, and it's a little icon on the dashboard with an exclamation point, and that means that your tires uh, need air. And so that's just a warning sign. So you want to make sure you get your air uh, in your tires checked uh, because they will. Add, when it turns cold, the uh, the cold weather will compress the tires, cause that light to go off. So get a little air because you want to be riding on the right amount of air in your tires. All right. Once again, Randy Harris with Express Oil. We'll have some more of his expertise coming up in the next half hour. Guys, back to you.